Oh hey there, I'm Jeff. Welcome to Oh Hey There with Jeff. Today, we're gonna to be talking about coolers and refrigerators. I'm here to talk about Overland, from how to's, advice, gear, vehicle builds, and everything in between. So let's take a look at what our options are. The cooler, it's tried, true, tested. Some people will say this is just not enough. It's not gonna do it for you when you're overlanding. But the fact of the matter is, it can do just fine. This is a heavy duty one. It's rough and tumble, it's very mobile. You can throw it around. Drawback of the cooler, it's not gonna keep things as cool for as long, right? Because you have to use ice. So, ice melts, it gets nasty, everything gets wet, and you gotta throw it out. But if you're going on a long weekend warrior trip, these are gonna work just fine for you. I like that you can pull these out super easy, put them anywhere in camp, set up your kitchen really quick, but it's not always the best option, right? So let's take a look at a refrigerator. We run refrigerators from National Luna, get them from equipped outfitters, and these things, I'll tell you what, they're awesome. So this guy keeps our, our stuff cold, has a freezer compartment as well, it's very functional, it comes with baskets so you can keep things organized. We like to generally keep breakfast stuff in one, dinner and lunch in the other, it's really quick. Also, it's really easy to clean. Stainless steel, um, smooth surfaces on the inside, you can wipe it out really quick. It's got an adjustable dial here, so you can adjust your temperature however you want it. It's got a turbo button, so you can cool things real quick. These things draw hardly anything, even on a single battery system. So there you go, these are some of the differences. They both have their place. If this is what you can afford in a cooler, go with it. If you can swing this thing, you're gonna be able to do longer trips with this a little bit easier, but this will serve your purpose as well. So I'd like to hear what you guys use, what are some alternatives, um, some things that have worked well for you in the past, what you wanna get if you wanna get something like this, how's it gonna fit into your rig, and how's it gonna make your life a little easier. So tell me what you got. Also, I'd like to hear what kind of food you're keeping at home because I enjoy food. So there you go. We'll talk to you next time.